Hey YouTube, what's going on? And today we have the second episode of this career mode. Sorry there isn't actually an intro to this, but we're just getting straight into the games. Arsenal at home to Sheffield United for this one. And yeah. Anyway, it's Lacazette. He plays it through to Thomas Pye. Thomas Pye in on goal, but he hits the post. It goes to Aubameyang though. He tries to cross it. Gets away. Pepe tries to get onto it. Dean Anderson saves it. It's Torreira. Plays it to Pye. He sees Sabayas. Sabayas first time. And it's 1-0. Anyway, here's Kolasinac to Thomas Partey. Here's Nicolas Pepe. Does a drag back. Does a second drag back. Sees Lacazette. Lacazette gets it onto his right foot. And he finishes that. What a finish there from Lacazette. We make it 2-0 in this game. He goes up to the camera. And what a finish that is. We win that game 2-0. Anyway, going into the round of 16 in the Europa League. We did sim the round of 32 and we got through. Anyway, it's Gabriel Martinelli here. Plays it to Ceballos, to Guendouzi. Guendouzi in on goal and he makes it 1-0. Nice finish. Anyway, going into the 15th minute, it's Bukayoko Saka on this left-hand side. Sees Martinelli. Martinelli through on goal. Just a tap in there. We make it 2-0. Martinelli gets the goal. Anyway, straight from kickoff, they go up the other end and they score. Really, really jammy goal, but they make it 2-1. Anyway, Mavropod is shoulder barges off, off the ball, but somehow the referee gives a penalty for that. Really do not know how, but they have a chance to make it 2 all. Like, he literally just uses his strength. Look, shoulder barge there. Yeah. He misses the ball when he tries to kick it, and it's a penalty somehow. Anyway, he goes up to take it, and he scores. They make it 2 all in this game. After us being 2 0 up. Anyway, from kickoff, Martinelli's in on goal. The keeper gets to it. Can the defender get there though? No, he cannot. And Martinelli makes it 3 2, literally from kickoff again. Anyway, going into the second half, it's Saka down this left hand side. He tries to pick out Sabas on the edge of the box. It deflects off their player, and Martinelli gets it. And he makes it 4 2. Hat trick for Martinelli there. Anyway, they're on the attack in the 80th minute. He plays it through and he volleys it. They make it 4-3, but we win that game. And we go through. Anyway, Man City away from home next. Anyway, it's David Luiz tries to shoot, but he gets a penalty somehow. Rodri getting the blame for it. And we have a chance to go 1-0 up. A really dodgy penalty there. Don't know what the ref was thinking, but we make it... Well, we're about to make it, hopefully, 1-0. Lacazette going up to take it. Not sure if I should have put Pepe on it, but, you know. He aims for that bottom left-hand corner. Goes up, and he scores. Really nice finish from Lacazette. And we make it 1-0 in this game. Really nice penalty. And, yeah. Anyway, it's into the 40th minute. It's Man City on the attack. De Bruyne to Bernardo Silva, to David Silva, to Aguero. And they score. Really nice finish. I just couldn't deal with their passing. They make it one all. Yeah, damn it. <laughs> anyway, it's up on them Carmo to Thomas Party first time! And what a finish that is! We make it 2 1. He goes into the away end. What a finish that is from our signing. Brilliant, brilliant goal. First time. Just like kind of finesses it into that top right hand corner. Goes straight into the side netting and we make it 2 1. Anyway, it's literally straight from kickoff. Sterling shoots, Leno saves, but David Louise fouls him whilst he's taking that shot and he gets the second yellow. Anyway, it's Aguero up to take this. He hits the post, I can't see anything, and Gundogan gets the rebound. So annoying. I dive the right way, but it doesn't matter because he hit the post, but Gundogan just gets that rebound. It's Bernardo Silva. Plays it into Gundogan, and Leno fluffs his lines. He really should have saved that. Bernardo Silva picks out Gundogan. It's literally straight at Leno, but he just can't get there. We lose that game 3-2, and we go into the semi-final of the Europa League. Sorry, I actually lost quite a lot of footage of my games, but, yeah, we're just going to have to make it a lot shorter. Bamiang's in on goal, but he just he just can't finish. Anyway, here, Bayer Leverkusen on the attack. 
centre mid. Plays it to to Volland. Up and kind of tries to get it away, but he volleys it, and Leno saves it, and we get it away. Anyway, going into the 50th minute, it's Aubameyang through on goal. Lacazette plays him through. Aubameyang in on goal. He has to take it with his left foot, and it doesn't matter though. We make it one nil and 3-1 on aggregate surely we should get through now and he blows for the full time whistle and we get through there 1-0 win anyway on to Tottenham really late in the season I don't know why we played them here this late second last game of the season but it doesn't matter and it was Lucas Moura with the shot Leno saves it though anyway it's Gwen Doozy plays out left to Saka Saka's got options he shoots though and what a finish that is right into the top left corner and we go 1-0 up in this game really good finish I wasn't actually expecting him to score that but he does really nice goal and yeah I wasn't playing the strongest of teams because this game didn't matter too much because uh, spoiler alert Man City ran away with it <laughs> Anyway, going into the 75th minute, it's Bukayoko Saka on this left-hand side again. Eriksen tackles him, but he gets the ball back. Bukayoko Saka's got options in the box. He tries to play it to Lacazette. Lacazette ducks for it. And Pepe tries to get there. It's Gwen Doozy trying to cross it, but they get it away. And that is all for those games. Right, OK, so we have finished the season. We came in third. We were second, and then City just ran away with it. They won 36 of their games. They drew one and lost one. Uh, Liverpool coming in second. 31 wins, three draws, four losses. Arsenal coming in third, which is me. 31 draws. No, 31 wins, one draw, six losses. And Spurs in fourth with 29 wins, four draws, and five losses. Whereas Chelsea miss out on Champions League. Wolves come in sixth. Man U 7th, bit of an odd season for them, and Sheffield United, Aston Villa and Southampton have all been relegated. Leicester coming in ninth. I know their team isn't that good on FIFA, but they're doing sick in real life at the moment. Anyway, so that's that's technically it. I think, I think we got knocked out of the FA Cup. Alright, we've won that replay. Oh, we got knocked out round five against Liverpool. See the other competitions. What did I get knocked out? Oh, Liverpool knocked us out again. Uh, Liverpool won the UEFA Super Cup. Champions League final is Liverpool versus Real Madrid. Oh, Bayern and PSG missing out on the final. And then we have Borussia Dortmund in the Europa League final. Oh, no one cares about that. Oh yeah, that's all the competitions done. So, all we need to do now is, oh my, let's see how much. 325 million pounds of profit. That is very good. Uh, how much have we got? So we've got like 82 mil in the bank and then we'll get all of our Awards. Well, on the training ground, Martin Lee was injured for a bit, so he went off the training. While Saka, Nelson, Willock, Gunduzi, all was in the same one. But I had a Pepe in. Oh my God! Basing your performance in the competition, clubs received additional funds. These funds will allow us to increase the chance. 173 million, man. Didn't even bloody win it. But yeah, I was doing all the. Um, happiness on the players and that whatever it's called team morale with that so they didn't get upset and like lose overall ratings and stuff but yeah all we have to do now is just <laughs> win this Europa League final and we I don't well this doesn't really matter well it does it matters for some money but it doesn't matter that much. We're already in the Champions League. A bit like Chelsea last season. It didn't matter, but they still still did their best and they beat us. All right. Just say I had quite a lot of players out on injured. Bellerin's been injured for most of this season, so I've been playing. I've been switching around with Tierney and Chambers. So 
also sound part he goes there uh, David Luiz will put him on the bench for Martinez because we won't use it actually no for Martinez then and David Luiz uh, but yeah I haven't really been using Martinez that much Olilanka's unhappy Martinelli put him on the bench for Smith Rowe keep Saka on he's been all right this season he did score a very good goal against uh, Tottenham which he would have seen all right that's our team ready just need to do the press conference and then we're we're ready for the Europa League final. all right let me just do this I've been in pretty f good form lately and I'm feeling good I'll consider it well you're, you're going in the team obviously all right here we go, press conference just before the Europa League final. Okay, welcome, Prussia we'll Dormant. You're, face, you're about to face Duffy from this final. Who is a strong opponent? Uh, can you tell. Well, how did you manage fatigue? Oh, so I don't know how to pronounce that, sorry. We worked hard to get here. Yeah, we kind of did. Is your previous win going to affect your opponent's morale? The lads performed. Ah, uh, good. Oh, uh, you're going to match against the storm with a lot more confidence. I think that our confidence will affect the morale of them. Okay. But do you think that they can t continue their f performance? Yes, of course I can. I've got full belief in the lads. That's all we I've got full belief in me because I'm controlling them. But yeah, who cares? <laughs> right. Which kit? We'll use. We'll use that one. Brushy Dorman with their home kit as well. Alright. Let's go. No, 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 actually no. Now let's go. I didn't... I don't want it to be overcast, man. I just... Just don't feel like it. Just put it on cloud. You're not changing any of the difficulty. See, you ready? There we go. Legendary difficulty like we've been doing all season. Yeah. This is it. This is it. <laughs> Real excitement and okay, this is here. it. Brussia Dorman versus Ball Arsenal. Europa League final. We'll which, which, um, Grant, is this Valencia's? I think it is. Uh, I don't, oh, actually, wait. I think it is. I think that is Valencia's ground. Yeah, I think Millions that is. Sorry if I'm wrong, but yeah, it's Valencia's. I just saw the little badge here. Yeah, you can see it to the left. Anyway, the boys are coming out. Here we go. There's the Europa League trophy. There we go. There's what we did. 8-3 against the round of 16 team. Okay. Kickoff has begun. Europa League final. Arsenal versus Borussia Dortmund. Let's do this. Nice Pepe. He's took that really well there. He's, he's running inside. Oh no, he tried to switch it back to Lacazette. She couldn't get there. Tobias. Oh, keeper's there. It's Torreira. Shoots. Oh. Defender blocks it. It's a party. We're just playing it around. It's a Bamiyang now on the ball. Cuts back. To Lacazette, ref! Yes, that's a penalty! Yes! Matt Hummels brings down Lacazette. This is a massive moment in the game to go 1 0 up. Lacazette's going to get in front of him and he just nudges him out of the way. Get a penalty. Oh, right, I'm going for Pepe. Come on, Pepe. He's been brilliant all this season. Don't let me down on this penalty, though. Top left. Yes, let's go! 1 0. Yes! Nice penalty there by Nicolas Pepe. Actually, it wasn't a good penalty. Wait, was it? Yeah, it was alright. It wasn't brilliant, but they all count. They all count. It's Kalasanach. A Bamiyang to party. It's a brilliant ball. Can we get two? He's in. Oh, I should have squared it across. It's just he took in like an extra touch when, and then I shot. Look, this is why I shot then and then Lacazette came. So, oh no. 
It's not, I, I'm trying to switch to Torreira, but it's not working. Away! Oh! Oh my god, how has Socrates not got to that? He's literally missed it, he's missed the ball. Oh my god, Julian Brandt though coming really close. Oh, and they bring on Royce. Why would they not just start? Oh, Alright. Oh, Whistle comes in with the challenge, it's the new man Royce coming onto the pitch. That's a really good ball. Sancho on the wing. Has nowhere to go, goes backwards. That's a good interception by Bamiyanga. It's another good challenge from Aubameyang. Defensive duties. It's another brilliant challenge from Aubameyang. Just get it out. No! Oh, no! No, there's no one on him! Oh, my God, he skimmed the post. Oh, my God. Just hit the side net in. Ah, it's not as close as I thought, but still we've been let off there it's a good header from Tin it's another good header from Thomas. Pepe party plays to Ceballos Lacazette's in come on come on come on Laka yes 2-0 yes let's go yes Lacazette with the goal oh my god we're on the back foot for the for this whole half. We get one attack and we score it. Two nil. We've got that two goal cushion. Plenty of space. He's still driving. That's a really poor ball though. It's good from Tierney. Oh, I tried dummying it with Pepe. Away. Oh, it's fell straight to Delaney. Marco Royce. Oh, it's not the greatest of shots there from Royce. I'm going to pass it to Kolasinac. It's a really, really good ball from Kolasinac there. Bamiyang's using his pace to get away from Hakimi. Drag back. It's Nicolas Pepe. Oh, just put too much power on it. We've got two minutes left. Come on. This is definitely going to be a W. The Europa League is coming back to Arsenal. Here's Nicolas Pepe. Goes through. Thomas Partey. Oh, he's dragged that so far. But it doesn't matter. We've won the Europa League. 2-0. Pepe and Lacazette, the scorers. Yeah, I love to see it. Please, man. Yes. 2-0. It's been a very, very successful season here at Arsenal. All the players jumping around. We are the champions. First bit of silverware that we've got this season. First bit of silverware for me as manager. But there it is, the Europa League. Here we go. Who's lifting it? Socrates is lifting it. Here it is. We're about to lift it. Oh, Arsenal, the winners of the Europa League. Oh my. It's a brilliant performance. No goals conceded, which is quite rare for Arsenal. <laughs> and they're going over to the fans just to celebrate. I don't want fans still. Still lifting their flags high, still waving them. The fireworks going off. And the photo. God, we've got a lot of stuff to watch. Well, you know exactly where I'd be sitting in that photo, don't you, Derek? I think I've heard it before, Lee. Martinez is just. It's hardly even seen. <laughs> but anyway, all the players loving it. And that remarks 
um, roller coaster of a season. Let's go into our last interview of the season, Europa League winners. Ooh, should I change it to ultimate next season? I don't know. I don't know if I'm that good, but let's not worry about that at the moment. We have won the Europa League. We're getting our interview. Like Dortmund nil, Arsenal two. Everyone was impressed with the level of competition by showing you. Are you expecting a clear victory over Borussia Dortmund in the final stage? We won the final, yeah, we won the final. <gasps> I, I can't be asked to read it, I'm sorry. Was Torreira's performance in today's win enough to grant him back? Was Torreira's performance in today's win enough? Well, he plays all the time. So, you know, quite a resounding victory day with 2 0 score. How pleased are you with your team's performance? We could have won by more. It is true. We no could have won by four. You. All right, last question. Oh my! We have won the Europa League. This is the league table. Let's see who's going up. All right, season of the leagues. League two, League one. All right, who's going up? You got West Brom. Cardiff and the playoff winners which could be Leeds United, Stoke, Huddersfield or Bristol. Okay. Yeah, it's seventh place, isn't it? Yeah. No, I'm Fulham. Wait. Right, so it could be No no no, it's only up to six, I think. So it could be Fulham, Leeds United, Stoke City or Huddersfield. You're coming back up. Oh, let's go, man. Finish the season with a profit margin of 225 million. Did that. Uh, didn't do that. <laughs> Three seasons and we've already done 50 53%. Oh, sorry, lads, I didn't do the FA Cup. All right, there we are. Season one finished. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I certainly did anyway. That's the end of the video. I can't be asked to go back and edit all that footage, but you've got to do it. Golden Boot winner, man, they got 31. Sterling with 24. Lacazette with 23. Pepe with 18. Where's Aubameyang? Aubameyang comes 19th with 12. Oh, God. Anyway. That is the end. I've already said this, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Yeah, see you guys in a bit.